Next, the MACD. The MACD is a very uh, commonly used indicator, the moving average convergence divergence. Um, you'll see the syntax, the actual formula is very, very simple. MACD open brackets, close brackets. There is nothing to be put inside the brackets. Don't put anything in there. Here's the key with the MACD. For those who don't know, the MACD is simply an indicator, a line which represents the difference between a 12-day exponential moving average and a 26-day exponential moving average. That is what a MACD is. The interesting thing about Metastock, Metastock on the surface doesn't allow you to vary the 12 and the 26. It's set. So if you put in MACD open brackets, close brackets, it will use the 12 and the 26 day moving averages. You cannot change that. They are not variables or properties you can change. If you want to use a different MACD with different values, you actually need to build your own indicator using those different values. We've actually provided you an example down the bottom there. So there's an example which uses a 10 and an 18 because you can't vary, you can't vary the um, MACD indicator that's actually in Metastock. You cannot change it. You have to build your own.